Hi guys, this is Sadek from Godwin.com. So we have just got the new Keybox module version 1.9 and the Keybox file which is the 29th file is of size 12.49 KB. So simply place the file in Tikiso directory or flash file module and then you will pass the strong test. Let me just show you once again. So you could see by passing the strong test. The steps to pass the strong test is quite simple. If you are calling to obtain root, so in that case, you may simply use my module as well to flash the module by APAS, KSU or Magisk. And after that, flash a few other mods as well. So first off, get this new module from here. And when that is done, go to my article over here. And then after that, flash this module. After that, flash a few other mods which are as follows. Let me show you. The mods are somewhat different case of Magisk, KSU or APAS. So let's talk about Magisk first. So as you could see from here, you have to flash the following modules, which is the LS4 is optional. Shamiko module, plain integrity fog, that is assistant tricky store. Get the file of keybox file and then root file manager app and a plain integrity API checker app. So once you flash that, these apps also install one more app, which is the tricky store add-on by module flash it by magisk. And then install the case of web UI app. Then you get the plain integrity fix, open this, then fetch the file of your JSON file. After that, you have to launch the tricky store and also get this job done. The steps are given here. Then if you flash a module, you will then get a keyboard file in the location of data table tricky store. You place the module, the file will place automatically on that location. Or if you want, you also get the file manually as well. So let's suppose if your phone is currently not rooted. In that case, you must simply ask the file from this article's comment section. Scroll down and then drop in your request. I'll share the file with you by email. So I will share the file over here. Once you have got the file, you may then manually get the job done as well. For example, in various custom ROM, you have to upload the file. In the keybox directory, it's usually given there. In the custom have their own section for the keybox. Or if you don't want to flash the model, then you can simply get the file from here and manually place the file in this directory. So it's is all yours. When that is done, we'll pass the strong test now. For module flashing, you should be aware of one fact that in case of KSU and APIs and magic. So for KSU and APIs, you have to flash a few other mods as well. For example, the Shamiko will not work in APIs and KSU. Like you have to also flash the K. The Zygis Next or the Rezygis module for both of these phones, the APIs and KSU. For Magis, we have the inbuilt Zygis, so that's not required. Please have a look at my article and the videos and get yourself acquainted and know what all the steps are required in the video is shown there and the steps is also shown in the article. So just to repeat and recall once again, if your phone is currently obtained root, flash my module and you will get the file over here automatically. Or if you have a custom ROM, you will simply ask the file via the article's comment section and share the file by email. Once you've got the file, place the file over here. It's the file of 12.49 KB. And guys, that's just about it. To flash the module, let me show you how to use the module. Just give me a second. Let's first remove this file from here. And let's now use our keybox module. And let me show you that as well, how to use it. It's quite simple. So let's get the file over here. Start download. And we should have got the file by now. Compress folder. This is the module. Let's transfer the file onto our phone. So Droidwin Keybox module version 1.9. It's the rich papaya and I guess it should be here only. This is the file. We have got it. So whether it's APAS, KSU or Magisk, just launch the app, go to modules, install from storage, choose the module file. Droidwin Keybox module version 1.9 is this one. Tap on OK. It's now flash, then do a reboot. It's a must. After a reboot, the keyboard file will be placed in the data database triggers to directory on its own. N nothing is required from your end. That is the best part of this module. So with that in mind, let's just wait for a few seconds. I'm using the plain integrity API checker app to check if you're passing the strong test or not. So first of all, let's verify if the module is up and running or not. Simply launch your routing app, API KSU or Magis, go to module section. And from there you could see it's now up and running. Likewise, it's the version 1.9. You may also open the files app. And you could see we now have a new keybox file placed over here. So we should now pass the strong test without any issue whatsoever. And let's see that is the case or not. So we are passing the strong test. So guys, that's all from this video. If you have any query, let me know in the comment section. And thank you for watching the video.